DITA XML stands for Darwin Information Typing Architecture. It was developed by IBM in the early 2000s and has since been adopted by many other organizations in industries such as software development, healthcare, and aerospace. DITA XML was designed specifically for creating modular, topic-based documentation that can be easily reused and repurposed across multiple contexts. Here are five different things that you can do with DITA XML but not with other markup languages. Reuse content across multiple outputs, DITA XML allows you to reuse content across multiple outputs, such as different versions of a product manual, online help, or a knowledge base. Facilitate content management, this makes it easier to manage content over time, including updating and repurposing content as needed. Single-sourced content with conditional output for corresponding audiences types, this allows you to create variations of the same content for different audiences based on user types. Example, support team, business partners, implementation team, training, and so on. Support translation workflows. It supports translation memory systems and translation exchange standards, making it easier to manage the translation process for content. Enable conditional publishing. DITA allows you to tag content with metadata that can be used to control when and where content is published, such as for specific product versions or customer segments. DITA XML has some unique benefits that make it a better choice in certain scenarios. Modular design, DITA XML topic-based data type design allows for greater reuse and flexibility in creating and managing content. Better support for content management, structured nature makes it easier to manage content over time, including updating and repurposing content as needed. Simplified translation management, this makes it easier to manage the translation process for content. Conditional publishing, DITA XML allows for conditional publishing, which enables you to tag content with metadata that can be used to control when and where content is published, such as for specific product versions or customer segments. Better support for specialization, this can help improve the effectiveness of your documentation. Overall, DITA XML is a good choice for organizations with complex documentation needs or large-scale documentation projects, as they can easily integrate with CMSs and DAC implementations. Talk to our experts today.